Hey guys, this is Darko. In this video, I'll share with you several slides from LG's presentation for new TVs for year 2023. This presentation and these slides will highlight improvements they did to their new TVs, mainly to the OLED TV series featuring Alpha 9 Generation 6 picture processor. So when it comes to picture improvement techniques powered by AI, LG highlighted three new areas, AI Super Upscaling, OLED Dynamic Tone Mapping Pro, which is now analyzing up to 20,000 blocks of the image, and HDR Expression Enhancer or Object Tone Mapping. I always like to read small text on slides, and here they've mentioned that OLED Dynamic Tone Mapping Pro is applied only to Alpha 9, Z3, G3 and C3 OLEDs, meaning that B3 is not getting this treatment. And for Expression Enhancer, again mentioned OLED TVs are getting it, plus 8K Mini LED model QNET 99. On this slide they are talking about AI Super Upscaling, that it has three components, resolution, then grain versus noise analysis and finally identification of human faces, bodies and characters to adjust the image. For me it will be interesting to test this grain versus noise, how TV will be able to detect and filter out noise for example but keep grain. On this slide LG is talking about Dynamic Tone Mapping Pro, how it is analyzing picture in up to 20,000 sections for better, more attractive looking images versus how most TVs are doing it by doing just one global tone mapping for the entire scene. Next we have explanation about HDR Expression Enhancer. Since AI can detect different objects on the screen, it can also apply different tone mapping and add local contrast enhancement for more three-dimensional effect and better sharpness. This is only applied to TVs with Alpha 9 processor in 2023 TV lineup, meaning to C3, G3 and Z3 models. Now coming to LG's G3 series with micro lens array technology and the brightest OLED TV up to date from LG. It's important to highlight that even though they are mentioning up to 70% brightness, uh, this figure is only available on 55, 65 and 77 inch models while 83 and 97 inch models are up to 30% brighter than conventional OLED TVs and by conventional LG is referring to B series, so in this case B3. And finally for LG's QNET Mini LED LCD TV series, LG highlighted better processing for the backlight, meaning better control of local dimming, for better contrast and better looking images. And coming to eye comfort, LG highlighted AI blue light reduction, uh, which this year is analyzing image and can change color temperature and intensity of blue for different objects. Uh, so skin tones this way can look more natural. Of course, this is taking you further away from faithfulness and director's intention of the image, but if you're concerned with blue light, then this can be a useful feature. LG also highlighted different certificates they received for their OLED TVs for eye safe, flicker free and glare free image. Guys, that's all I wanted to share in this video, thanks for watching, if you want to see the entire presentation then check the link in the description, also if you want to download TV lineup PDF document with all models available in my region, you can also find the link in the description. I'll test many of these features with C3 OLED TV which I will receive for testing next month, so in July. 
And until then, let me know what you think about these improvements. And if you already own LG's 2023 TV, let me know your thoughts and your experience with it. Wish you all a nice day.